Yo, what's up, sexy Samuel squad? How you guys doing? After yesterday's Denza Buro full power build, a lot of people in the comments were telling me, ah, you just gotta go, you gotta go full attack speed. Like the devs were trolling you, telling you to go full power. And trust me, trust me, buddy, buddies, not buddy, but buddies. Um, I will be. Hold on, let me move this over a tad bit. I don't. Oh God! Ah, jeez! Oh God! Oh jeez! No, I, it's still too far over. I want it like there, but then I'm like over here in the corner. I don't know. I'll move it here for now, I guess. Anyways, let's build our build. Do 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 do. He's set, so I'm gonna go ages. Um, basically, people were telling me, Sam. You got trolled. He is an auto attack character and the fact that they said he wasn't was trolling you and now you think he's a bad god. Well, because of that video, I thought, well, I didn't think, I don't think often, but I felt the need to do a full auto attack speed build. I gotta do the bow build, the meta, the meta build of Hunters in Conquest and I just felt like you know, after the Denza Burrow madness that happened in yesterday's video, I felt like I owed it to myself to see what true power is. What true power is. Um, I clear pretty quick, so I'm actually just going to be a little bit aggressive. Um... Am I scared of him? Oh, yes, I am. Yes, I am. He got level 5. Which means he double buffed and I was not expecting it. I got a message. Oh. Well, thank you, buddy. Thank you. I got a message from somebody named Cuddles. It was a kind message. I wonder if he's named Cuddles because everyone wants to cuddle him. Anyways, this build is very bad until late game, so maybe instead of trying to fight a level 5 set, I should have maybe been a little bit smarter with my positioning and not fought the level 5 set. But, now he's not level 5, he's level 6, so maybe... <laughs> okay, he's level 7? No, he's level 6, so okay. My damage has not gotten better. Can I have that, please? Your tower is under I have a feeling he's not going to let me out. Yeah, I had, a, I had a feeling. I had a feeling. He's got no abilities now, right? Oh. Guess it doesn't matter. Um, hmm, he probably has his alt up. Wow, that didn't kill him. He probably has his alt up. I'm just gonna back. I'm gonna get my devos. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be a good little, a good little boy. I'm gonna go sit in my cage and wait. Sit in my cage and wait. Wait for my power spike, baby. And trust me. I'm about to spike. Well, okay, <laughs> that's a lie. I'm not about to spike, but I will spike at some point in this game, and it will be glory. Glorious. Glorious. <laughs> oh, baby, would you look at that clear? My man's just clearing everything. Does my 3 do damage? I can't tell. I think it did. Um, oh, it does. It doesn't do very much. But it does do damage. My 2 is an auto attack, by the way. Did you guys know that? I didn't knew... I, I didn't knew. I really said that out loud. I didn't know that Cherno's 2 was literally just considered an auto attack. 
until somebody crit me with it. And I didn't know that it could crit. Anyways, I haven't done a Cherno video in a long time, so I hope you guys are enjoying this one. I mean, obviously nothing's happened yet, but that's just because of the build path I'm choosing and the fact that I'm fighting a set. Honestly, with my Aegis and my 3, I should never die. Like, I don't know how I got first blooded. Well, I know how. It's because I didn't think he would be level 5, and then he was, and then I died, but... I have no mana. Darn. Darn it. I mean, his ult being put down is a big deal, right? Like, that means I can just build this, like this, these boots, and this, and then I should be able to fight him, right? Because he doesn't have his ult. Or does he have Transcendence finished, and I'm big badoodled anyways? He doesn't have Transcendence finished. Okay, this is the time. This is the time we fight. His shell is down. I have my Aegis. He has no ult. I'm not scared of an idiot. I'm only scared of idiots. I'm dead. I'm dead. Alright, I'm running. Damn it, dude. I missed everything. The darn teleport. Frick. Frick, frick, frick. It was 68 power, huh? Really not very much power. Can't even pick that up. Where's my ult to? Please clear. Where's my ult to? Damage mitigation, shadow clone speed. What is shadow clone speed? Is that how fast I fly towards them? Or no, that's how fast my shadow clones chase them. But they don't do anything, do they? They just lower movement speed? Yeah, shadow slow. Hmm. Well. This may perhaps be a difficult video. I feel like he's just waiting to kill me. My hearing is as sharp as my horns. You can't hide from me. Oh hi. Oh, he died. Perfect. Perfect. Doesn't matter if he killed me. He used his shell and his thorns. And he died. That's so good for me. I mean, it's not that good, I suppose. Because, like, at the end of the day, I didn't get anything off of it. But, well, did I get anything off of it? I actually don't know. But, what it does mean is that potentially I could fight him. He doesn't have anything up right now. And that's a big deal. That is a big deal. I'm gonna get thorns. Then I'm ulting. Why didn't my character get stuck there? I don't want to fight when his 3 is up, because his 3 is a big deal. His 3 frags. Alright, I think he's just going to go straight to Bull Demon now. Oh, hi. Okay. I got the red buff down. 
So he didn't get it. Unfortunately, he waited long enough to where he can do Bull Demon, and I can't do anything about it, so... They definitely don't ever win a fight against him. When he has all of his relics and his ult, and I have one of my relics and no ult, there's definitely nothing I can do about that. So, unfortunately, we just kind of have to wait and sit back and hope that maybe he doesn't understand what good of a position he's in. Also, that mid guard makes me think Kins is going to be good. I'm just going to push the wave. Oh, never mind. He's actually waiting for me to get my ult up. What a gentleman. I don't hear him doing anything. Very nice kill, dude. Very nice kill. Okay. Big deal. Big deal. The reason that's a big deal is one, because um, he got the bull demon. So it kills time on the bull demon buff. And we get to kill his tower, which is a huge, huge bonus. And I get the back. And I didn't die. So good. All amazing stuff. Um, I do want a Kins, because I think Kins will do a lot for me, but I also want an Oboe. So I think I'm just going to wait for Oboe and then try to fight him again. He's getting a Toxic Blade. My lifesteal is not an issue in these fights. He could still get Phoenix, by the way. Looks like he's just going to red buff, though. No Phoenix for him today. Hell yeah. You're not getting this today, bud. No way, Jose. Hmm. Phoenix is back up. On the same level as him. Surprised he just backed there, actually. I don't need to use any abilities to clear the wave now because I have good attack speed and I have the oboe with it. So my clear is pretty good. Also, apparently my two procs oboe. I didn't know that, but, it, you know, learn something new every day, I suppose. Uh, I'm going to go Kins now. Because he's building a lot of HP. With mid guardian and the witch blade instead of a wing or instead of a toxic blade. He's building a lot of HP. I'm gonna try to nip that in the bud. Just farming. Not going out of my way to farm, though. You know, I don't want to get risky with it. I just want to chill. Relax. Do my farm shit. It's 650. It got nerfed. It's always been 600. Or has it always been 650? <laughs> Maybe I'm an idiot. I, th I think it might have always been 650. I'm scared. Puppy, hold me. Puppy, please. Oh, puppy. He's over there. He's backing. All right. He is backing. Let's go. I would go. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> um, this doesn't actually stop any amount of life steal. Upgrading that. So yeah. Okay. I was gonna alt because I didn't see him yet, but
That's a mistake. Going stone cutting next item. Alright. I can definitely put some respect on that stone cutting. He just used his three, so we're hard chilling. Use my two here. I do want this. I'm scared because when I'm over here doing this buff, I can't hear the bull demon happen. And not being able to hear bull demon happening is a big deal. Because if he gets that and I'm not there to stop it or fight him. Hold on, I'm listening. I don't hear it. I'm going to turn my headset up, actually. So that I can hear better. Okay. Well, let's turn my headset back down because it doesn't matter anymore. Unfortunately, I tried to fight him. And he just used everything at once. And uh, and I couldn't do anything against him. Because, like, I had to run, right? Like, I, there's no way in hell that I ever fight him while he's ulting. But his ult lasted so long. Like, the entire time I was in the wall, plus my Aegis, he still had his ult after that. So, that really sucks. I don't think I'm able to stop him from doing this. No. Definitely not. I might be able to fight him when he doesn't have ult. I still have a minion, man. That's all I need. Mm. I don't care about blue buff, do I? This is basically what I have to do, by the way. Yes! Nice! The traded kill, dude. Nice. Very nice. That's so good. Oh my god, that's so good. That lets me get my silver branch online. And my silver branch is what's going to give me all of the power in this build. Like, I didn't build all this attack speed so I could not get silver branch and have no power. And this silver branch is going to stack everything together. He just used his alt and he just used his upgraded thorns. Which, by the way, did 706 damage to me, apparently. Um, But that's so good for me. That's actually so good for me. All right, and then we clear this wave that's gigantuan. I know it's gargantuan or gigantism, but it's a giganticism. Gigantuan? What did I say? <laughs> it doesn't matter. Okay, let's get the silver branch. Hell yeah. And boom, just like that, an extra 24 power. And then I use my two, and during my fight, I'm getting an extra 80 power, dude. 80 power. Like, I just got 80 power like that, bro. That's a big deal. Holy. I have lifesteal and I have my phoenix coming up, so it's a big deal. Huge deal, dude. Look at that, man. Look at that. 
He uses everything he has and still he kind of loses the fight. Super good. Super, super good. Now, all I need to do is sell my boots for an Atalanta's bow so I have all the penetration in the world. And we are golden. Now, right now, by the way, I will lose a fight. I will lose the fight. So I gotta be careful. My damage is big. My damage is big. Just push him back whenever I can, you know what I mean? Oh, I lost. Damn. The thorns. The thorns. He TP'd in on me and the thorns got me. I don't know. I tried, man. I tried. At the end of the day, I think I did a pretty good job, but it just isn't enough to beat a set who, you know, stack the HP and the defense and whatnot. And I had no defense as well, so it is what it is. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, guys, peace.